organized gang stalking and community harassment. We will watch and record, exposing and punish those involved. We are part to destroy. And the description is people from all walks of life are being recruited to be the eyes and the ears of the state. People from all races, ages, genders, and every sector of society that you can think of is part of this. A targeted individual is a person who has been put in a depopulation program known as gang stalking. The program is funded by the government, and the TI is monitored and harassed 24 hours a day, seven days a week, inside and outside of their home. Most TIs have no idea how they were put into this program or how to get out. And for that matter, there is no way out. You are stalked from the day you are put into this program to the day you leave this earth. Targeting can happen to anyone in society. In the past, primary targets of programs, of programs such as COINTELPRO have been minorities. Targeting, however, can happen to anyone. Individuals are often targeted for being outspoken, whistleblowers, dissidents, people who go up against wealthy corporations, women's groups, single women, anti-war proponents, and other innocent individuals. The majority of the targets are often not aware that they are being targeted in this way. For those targets that are aware that this is happening, they can be left feeling depressed, suicidal, confused, isolated, and mentally unstable. The objective, the objective of the campaign it's a total destruction of the target. This program, you guys, is hell on earth, and that's the truth. So tonight we'll discuss this little known and seldom talked about program. There are many depopulation programs going on right now, and as history has it, there always have been these type of programs. However, I believe there is more of these programs now than there ever were. And these are basically campaigns, campaigns against humanity. And this is just one of those campaigns. And like I said, it's called gang stalking, and there are other names that it, that it goes by. Um, but this is very um, a little known program, and it's, it's not talked about very often. It's you know the the person that is the subject of the target, they're felt feeling alone. They're feeling depressed. They're feeling like they can't talk to anyone about this. Um, they they may feel like they're going insane, although they know what's happening to them. But the way the program is sickly designed is that if you mention this to someone, you sound crazy. And that is their point exactly, to make you look crazy, to make you sound crazy. Um, you're followed, like I said, you're harassed 24-7, inside your house, outside your house, at work, at school, and yes, this does happen to children as well, at church, yes, at church, it happens at church, anywhere you go, you are harassed. People are recruited through what is called a smear campaign, which is they'll tell a lie um, on you. And when I say they, this program, I'm kind of jumping ahead of myself, but this program is, is, is an extension of the COINTELPRO program, which was put together, um, I don't know the exact year, but it was to uh, disintegrate different groups like the, um, the Black Panther movement and any kind of movements that were going on, the FBI would follow and harass these people to disband them. They would frame them, they would set them up, they would say they rape people, they would, it, it was terrible.